Dragon Army Productions presents Dragon Talk with Draki the Little Dragon. Why, hello, hello, hello again, everybody. Draki the Little Dragon here on Dragon Talk. Today on Dragon Talk, well, this girl is going to rant. And here's, here's the whole entire topic of this rant. Stupid... Stupidity in today's society. Why do people run and tell tell people stupid shit such as the landlord, your teacher, your parent, neighbor, police officer, whatever, whoever the fuck it is, that somebody didn't do the dishes, didn't take the trash out, didn't feed the cat. The cat climbed up the drapes knocked off the curtain rod and fell on the couch and got and bust out of the drapes like a demon that just snorted crack or some shit. Excuse me, I do not like talking about drugs at all, but this is a rant. Who fucking cares? Oh god, my hair's annoying. Anyways, okay. It's simple logic. You don't go to your teacher, your landlord, or whatever. It's like, oh, my best friend uh, took my eraser. My my roommate didn't do the dishes, didn't take the trash out. Left their shoes all over the floor. Left their clothes in the bathroom. It, or just something entirely stupid like that. You don't, don't run to the landlord, the teacher, the psychiatrist, the whoever the fuck it is. You don't do it. It's annoying and it all it does it is piss people off. It pisses people off. If it's not important such as, oh... Somebody broke the window. That's important. Some creep tried to rape me. That's important. Somebody tore the door off. Some giant came into the yard and tore the door straight off the hinges and ate my favorite lasagna. That's important. You don't, don't run to the landlord and say, such and such didn't do their dishes. It is entirely annoying. It's happened to me numerous times in the past couple of months, and it is getting old. I just tried to explain this to my roommate, that if it's not important, don't bug the landlord about it. Because all it does is it, the li okay. Roommate supposed to be a property manager. Okay, supposed to manage this th this property. This property. That means mowing the lawn, taking care of the maintenance, blah 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 blah. We all know what a property manager does. Takes the rent, takes the 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 money for the bills and all that good jazz. What a property manager does not do is run to the landlord saying the trash ain't taken out. Somebody's socks are completely covering the entire floor from left to fucking right, top to bottom, and they haven't cleaned it up for a week. No, you don't do that. You go directly to the person and ask, can you do your dishes? Can you pick up your socks? It's like, yeah, I will do it when I'm done with this. I will do it when I'm back from Fairmount. I I will do it when the cows come home. And the cows do come home. It's, it's a proven fact. They do come home. Yeah. Okay. I, like I was trying to, like I was, uh, I got off, a little bit off topic there. 
Oh, it's the cows coming home and all. Um, I got yelled at for something as stupid as dishes, and among other things, got things got brought up such as a, my dog's accident, and he has a sensitive stomach and all. I've been adjusting his diet. I've been working with him. I take him out. I take him potty. I feed him. I water him. I do all that good stuff. And yet, it's complained about left and right. It's not important. It's not a matter of life and death. It's not going to kill you. It is not important. Now, something important would be... The breaker box is broken. Half the breakers blew up. That's important. Dishes? Not important! Really, people? Not fucking important. I know this is my first first rant, you, rant here on YouTube, and I do apologize for the cursing, but this is a, ma this is a matter of stupidity in today's fucking society. Normally, somebody as stupid as that goes snitching about every little petty thing to the landlord. I would beat them down. Beat them down. Snitches get stitches, as they say. But you know what? I'm too nice of a fucking person to go beat up somebody over something stupid petty like that. Because, okay, here's the vicious cycle I was talking about earlier. Roommate goes tells... Landlord, dishes aren't done. Landlord comes to me yelling at me. I yell at roommate who who bitched at the landlord who bitched at me, and it's a vicious cycle. And it, it, it and it's all because of the the roommate's fucking stupidity of running and telling on some something that didn't even fucking matter. Come on, people. Smarten up. Use your brains. Use your God-given fucking brains. Who, whatever fucking God, whatever fucking religion you fucking believe in, gave you that fucking brain to use. It's simple fucking logic. Simple logic. Cram it in your head. Don't be retarded. Seriously, do not be retarded. And run to your teacher saying, Oh, such and such stole my eraser. Yeah, yeah, that, that's theft. Who cares? It's an eraser. They're 25 cents a fucking dozen at the fucking dollar store. Go get a new one. Dishes aren't done. Either do them or ask the person who did it, didn't do them if they're going to do them. Trash ain't taken out. Ask the person to take out the trash. Take it out yourself and then ask them, can you take it out next time? The, the person who got asked if they could take it out next time will either say, yes, I can, or no, I can't, or yeah, I will try to if I remember. It's simple. It's simple fucking logic, people. Simple logic. Simple, bloody logic. Nobody I have ever lived with or been around has been that stupid. I have lived with numerous roommates and not a single one have bitched to the landlord about something as petty as dishes or trash or the cat running up the damn curtains. Was done or hasn't done or was done or has not, has what has never been, has been, or will ever be done. And told, and told, or snitched, or what, whatever the fuck you call it, that such and such happened because it's so petty, it doesn't matter. It just doesn't matter, people. Use, it, use your logic and ask yourself, hmm... Is this petty? Is this important enough to go to, go to teacher, go to landlord, go to preacher, go to president about? Really, not that anybody would ever go to Trump about anything, but s literally, uh, un un 
unless it's a, a matter of national security, such as the Russians are launching a nuke into our atmosphere to break the atmosphere, to blow up the atmosphere and suffocate the whole entire fucking world because they're goddamn fucking lunatics. That 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 would be a national that would be national security, world security, everything security, every but yeah, that that would be important. What's not important is dishes being done! Trash not being taken out. Oh my fucking god! This society is breeding fucking idiots! Seriously, I, I I know my my voice is going in between feminine and masculine, and I'm supposed to be a girl, and I am a girl, but literally, people don't be stupid. Use your God-given brains. Use them. That's what they're there for. For logic. It, it's that your brain is there to say. Is this important enough to tell somebody about? It is not. Oh my god. Really. People are so fucking stupid. Excuse me, I'm going to take a drink of my energy drink here that I've been drinking on since noon today when I woke up. And yes, I am not recording in my office today. I'm actually recording in my bedroom sitting on, sitting on my bed. And yeah, you see my hand shaking. That that's the Parkinson's acting up, plus the the extra stress of everything that's happened today. I had something to go to go to two towns over to take care of, and then when I got then then upon my return, I was gonna do every single dish in that sink, whether they were mine or not. And the bitch, the, the bitch cunt from hell that I fucking live with, who was originally supposed to make my life better, who's done nothing but make it a living fucking hell, called my landlord, my ex-boyfriend, while I was over there, bitching about the dishes, which only served to aggravate me. And raise my voice about it uh, while over there. The the bitch is completely stupid. She's a fucking retard. I try to be civil. I I do. And here, here's another thing. I'm gonna take another drink before I before I go into this next part of the rant. Here's another thing, people. Here's another thing. If you're gonna have a kid, make sure they're raised right. And if they do have problems such as autism or whatever, make sure they know right from wrong. Make sure they don't grow up being completely stupid and don't understand logic. Uh, some people are so stupid in the society, they go have a kid, and that kid is even stupider than they are. Really, people. Oh my fucking god. Wake up, smell the coffee, pull your heads out of your fucking asses. Use those brains that God or the gods or whatever fucking religion you believe in has given you for something other than putting it up your goddamn fucking ass. Literally. People are fucking stupid, so stupid in this society. And, it, and smart people like me... Smart people like Einstein, who honestly try to make the society better, and people like me, I, I, I'm no Einstein. Um, I, I've, I haven't done anything with my life hardly, other than going in the military. 
but at least I tried. I tried to make this world a better place. I went, yes, I went in the military. Yes, I got, yes, I got my ass blown up. In my fucking truck. Rolling down the high, rolling down the road in Iraq. Hitting an IED that luckily delayed enough before it went off to hit my fifth wheel. Only knocking my truck up so far. Which allowed me to ride it, and get it off road and head, drive to the front of the convoy with the pedal to the metal before the truck gave out. Yeah, I served my country in the army. And even now today, I would give my shirt off my own back to a homeless person freezing in the fucking snow. Because he didn't have a fucking shirt. That's how, uh, that's how kind and generous I am. Okay, people? Oh, really? Really? Today's society has gone downhill. I'm not even proud to call myself human. Hell, I don't even call myself human anymore. I, I, I call myself a dragon. Because I try to be, I try and strive to be better than human. Because I use my brain, I use my brain, people, for logic, for something other than sticking it up my goddamn fucking ass. If it's not important, don't, just don't run to your teacher, your landlord, your boyfriend, your mother, your father, your aunt, your uncle, your grandpa, your grandma. The President of the United States of America. Hell, don't even run to Paul fucking McCartney. To tell him something so petty as something wasn't done. Such as dishes, trash, whatever the fuck it was. Cat running up the drapes, knocking the curtain right off. Something, things that aren't are important. Okay, let's recap. Important. Breaker box. Breaker box blue. Completely blue. That's important. That's something landlord needs to know. That's something parent, teacher, anybody would, would need to know. I, I, that, that's important. That's important. Missile strike. That's important. I lost my phone. I need a new one. That, that's something to tell your parent about. That's important. The air conditioner blew up. That's important. The pipes broke. That's important. The roof is leaking. That's important. Not... Things that are not important. Lawn wasn't mowed. Dishes aren't done. Trash isn't taken out. Cat ran up the curtain rod. Socks over the all over the floor. Dirty laundry in the bathroom all over the place. Uh, cans all over. Dishes ain't done. Yes, I already said that. I said that about a million times. Yes, I'm hung up about the dishes right now because that that's what. That's what I got bitched about, bitched at about today. Got yelled at. Got my got laid into for something that I was gonna do when I get back. When I got back from fucking Fairmount, two towns over, just that way, literally, straight that way, literally, it's literally straight that way down the road. You gotta be fucking kidding me if you're too stupid to understand what's important, what's not important, and what to tell somebody about, what not to tell somebody about. My sister got raped. That's something important to tell somebody about. My dog shit on the floor. So what? Clean it up. That's not important. It happens. Dogs 
have accidents. Cats have accidents. Pets have fucking accidents, people. That's not something to run to the landlord about every fucking time because it's petty. It is really petty fucking bullshit, people. And if you're too stupid to understand this fucking logic, just go away. Just go away. Get out of society. Lock yourself up in an insane asylum. <clears throat> or something. Go live in the woods by yourself where, you, where you're not part of society. Just just split off from society completely if you're too stupid to understand that. Understand this simple fucking concept as logic about what's important What's not important? Because if you're too stupid, like my fucking roommate up, up right above my fucking head. Literally, she's right above my fucking head in the bedroom. Right above my head. If you're too stupid like her, get out of fucking society. Get out of fucking society. And don't be a part of it. Really. It is that simple. Go be a fucking hermit. Live by yourself. Don't don't be part of society. Don't vote. Don't do shit. Don't follow. You can do whatever the fuck you want outside of society. Go live on a fucking deserted island for all I fucking care. Launch yourself into fucking space. Do whatever the fuck. But don't. Don't disrupt. Society. With your stupidity. Do not infect today's society with any more stupidity than is already here. We have enough of it. We really have enough fucking stupidity in today's society to last us a fucking lifetime, people. Really. It, it... It, it, it's it's freaking simple. It, it, it's 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 really that simple. Step outside of society, get out of it, or smarten up and be part of society and be smart and use and learn to use that fucking logic in that brain that the gods, that God, that whatever fucking religion deity you believe in has given you to use and not stick up your ass and it's like oh I'm gonna run to such and such and tell them that there's a tire in the tree such and such didn't get to get it out of the tree they put it in the tree or the dishes are not done and they're suddenly, and suddenly, they're they're actually this would be kind of cool, floating out of the window magically up to um, Mount Everest. Yeah, that that's it, Mount Everest. They're suddenly floating to the top of Mount Everest to clean themselves and float their little happy asses back down and land themselves dry, completely dry in their proper locations. That would be something pretty cool to tell somebody about if it were to happen. But not cool to rat on your roommates about something as stupid and petty as the dishes not being done right away that very fucking second. That is stupid. Stop sticking your heads out of your up your stop sticking your heads up your asses, people, and pull them out of your goddamn asses and use that goddamn brain you were given. Now I hope you enjoy my rant people. I really do. I, I do apologize for all the cursing and all my nose itches. Sorry, I t I'm a bit moody today. Um, my time of the month, actually. 
as embarrassing as that is, but um, on another note, if you like my channel, or like my videos, please consider uh, hitting that red support button down there, knocking, the, uh, ringing my bell to n get the notifications, smashing my like buttons, the, 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 the little thumbs up button, that, that's the like button, people, smash it, really smash it. On my channel page, I've got the links to everywhere I am up in the top right hand corner. I've got my Facebook page. I've got my Discord page. I got my Discord chat channel right there. Top right hand corner of the uh, where's the camera? Yeah, top right hand corner of the channel page. It's it's right it's right up it's right up there. Yeah. It's right up there, people. Top right hand corner of the channel page. Of the channel banner. And I got my PayPal up there. And soon I will have my Reddit link up there as well. So if you feel like dropping a donation to me in PayPal, feel free. I will also have my um, Patreon up there as soon as possible. I know I've been saying I'll have my Patreon up for quite a while now. But... Yeah, um, I'm still working on that. Um, real life kind of, like I, like I said in a few videos past, real life got a hold of me really bad there for a while. Shit was going seriously south on me, but um, yeah. Anyways, uh, also, I'm working on some merchandise at this very moment. I'm coming up, I'm designing t-shirts actually for my dragon, my, yeah, my dragon army of fans out there. Yes, my dragon army of fans, I, I adore you all. I thank you for watching my videos. I really appreciate it. Help me get to 500 and I will show you my tits. Literally, I, 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 I promise you I will. I will show you my tits if you get me to 500 supporters. But not not that I have that that great of a rack, but it's acceptable. Okay, that that was a bit that was a bit over the top perverted, but I do apologize. But <laughs> I will do something crazy crazy like that if you guys get me to five hundred uh, supporters. Hell, I will even river dance to Devil Went Down to Georgia for you and eventually uh, I would like to do a video series of go going down uh, highway 66 route 66 actually in bumpity boo Mach 2 which is my vi do uh, 1989 Dodge Caravan which is she's sitting right outside in the driveway I'll actually do a video on her as soon as I get her cleaned up uh, I know I've mentioned her a few times, and oh, I forgot. I need to do some woofy videos and get them up here pretty soon. Some fresh woofy videos. I know you guys have not seen my dog Woofy in in quite a while, so I will get Woofy back up on YouTube here pretty soon, or fairly soon. Anyways, uh, everybody, blessed be. This is Dracky Little Dragon. Signing out for now, and remember, stay scaly.